put in strength. You put in time. You sacrifice. Through meeting God, spending time with God, being familiar with God, not the things of God, and then being friendly with God. Somebody who knows God very well in this dispensation, you can be in the middle of a torture and you are there, no, you just start talking, say, uh, God, Charlie, we have to talk. Let's, let's have a conversation. <laughs> That's somebody who is familiar and friendly with God. Let's have a conversation. That person is not waiting to come for Thursday or Friday service to, to pray some prayers. <laughs> somebody who is familiar with God in the middle, in the middle of a meeting, can have a conversation, can just turn the chair and say, God, Charlie, let's talk. Papa, we're in some no can I say, and pass on Bisa, what's happening? Let's talk. What should I say? Talk to me. Talk to me. What should I say? What should I say? That is why the Bible says that do not worry what you will say or what you do when they are coming at you. Because in that same minute, that same hour, he will give you utterance and will give you what to say. Those are for people who are friendly and familiar with God. And not the things of God. We have become so familiar with the things of God that we know that when we come to church from 7.30 to 8 is worship time. So the things, you know, but we are not familiar with this God that we are coming between 7.30 and 8 you know, to claim to worship. We have become familiar with the drums. When um, 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 uh, Olaf is not around, we can tell oh, something is different. The way this person is playing, 